Whew. The winds are chilly, but the sun is warm to balance it out. And I just wanted to come out here from my man cave to enjoy it. For this episode of Thorgoras Vlogs, I have figured out how to raise the frame rate and quality for my raw footage filming. So I'm gonna try this out right now. That way, once y'all get to finally watching it, it'll look a bit more crisper, clearer, and the frame rate will flow much like the popular YouTubers on the net right now. <sighs> it is so beautiful outside. I am ready for spring. Look at those flowers. It's as if the pagan pantheon are reminding me that there's still hope for the world. But on to the point. Without further ado, tonight I am going to go see the Canadian prog master himself, Devin Townsend! Here's my boy Brian, the guy I went to meet with over at the E-Works kiosk. What's up? Yeah, I didn't get a good shot of him before because he works in their camera policy, you know. But I guess he told everyone about what you saw. No. So tonight we are headed over to the Center Stage Theater for the aforementioned baldy guy from Strapping Young Lad, Hawkin and the Contortionists. And uh, let me show you a new addition that I bought. Oh lordy, an unboxing video. Right here we have my new tech key, which is a Android USB storage connector. This will allow me to record more footage and store it on here and not have to worry about running out of space. So I can get a lot more footage and hopefully have a much better video with more content for y'all. Hey Jimmy, I, I can do an unboxing too. Look what I found in my pocket. My name ain't Freddy, but I sure got fingered. <laughs> Just now arriving, shit ton of traffic. By the time we get inside, the contortionist should be all geared up and ready to play. See y'all indoors. Well, this night quickly turns sour. I make it all the way here to the venue. The thing said there were still tickets this morning. I get here and it is fucking sold out. Unless I can get an extra ticket, I'm gonna be sitting here all fucking night. Update, it looks like I may have a bit of luck. There's this friend of a friend of mine who's probably gonna be able to bring me an extra ticket. So let's go back outside the venue and wait for him. Shit, or not. It for heavy metal Jamiro fly. Yeah, Waiting in this long line to take a piss. That was more like watching jazz than metal. From a personal standpoint, Hawkin is a little too proggy for me. But from a professional standpoint, hey, they're virtuoso gods. I wish them well. And hey, I did like that guy's new retro wave glasses. Devin Townsend's got a Mike Portnoy set. You know it's a prog show when there's a bunch of glasses wearing hipsters around. Look at all the stuffed animals. <laughs> Devin's in the hizzy! I realize that a Care Bear's nose is a heart. 
He's got a heart on. Someone hurled on the floor. Some kick-ass coffee table metal or what? Pretty much. You want to go have a Starbucks espresso after that? <laughs> so that was Devin Townsend. Such a strapping young lad, isn't he? Jim, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Three thing of beer from this friend of mine. Cheers. Finally back home. That was such a lucky streak. I almost did not get to see Davin. I thought the end of this night was gonna end with me having a shit fit. Things did turn out well. I miss the contortionists though, but they always come here. Hawkins talented, but personally a little too jazzy and not so much metal for me. Davin's fucking great. So now, after this interesting night of stress and thrills, let us journey back into my little man cave where I can chill out and make friends with my best non-human friend. Mary Jane's a friend to anybody. She'll chill you out after any stressful day. It may have been a stressful start, but at least I got to get in and see Devin. Any concert experience that involves stuffed animals is pretty heartwarming. And this is coming from a guy whose favorite band is Slayer. This has been a pretty interesting episode, huh? Hope y'all enjoy my pain and anguish as well as my pleasure. Night viewers, have a good one.